So apparently a group of hackers called ransomed.vc claims that they have hacked Sony. So should you be worried? The answer is maybe. So apparently they are a new outfit of hacker. They have only started operating since September. They claim to be a secure solution for addressing data security vulnerabilities within companies while also operating in strict compliance with GDPR and data privacy laws. In cases where payment is not received, we are obligated to report a data privacy law violation to the GDPR agency." End quote. So basically what they're saying is we hack uh, various groups and steal their data, and then we demand ransom for it. And when these companies, if they don't pay us, then we are obligated to go to the authorities and tell them that, oh, these companies are not safe because their data is hackable, stealable. So we are obligated to go to the authorities and, and report you for not you know, keeping date, data safe, which is an odd way of working, but that's what they do. And basically to provide proof that they have hacked Sony, they have provided screenshots of Sony's internal login page, an internal PowerPoint presentation outlining test bench details, several Java files, and a document tree of the entire leak, which is just under six, thousand files so basically they've shown screenshots of the things that they have hacked however certain was it cyber connects basically has come out and said that it's unlikely that this is that this data was actually leaked it might just be this group claiming that there was a leak, trying to get money trying to extort money out of uh, sony however it has yet to be confirmed one way or the other the group did say that they have a post date set for september 28th so that's tomorrow so they said that they left details for sony to contact them uh, but they also said we have successfully compromised all sony systems we won't ransom them we will sell the data due to sony not wanting to pay data is for sale we are selling it however they have not put up a sale price yet and they say that they're going to dump everything tomorrow if Sony doesn't pay or nobody buys it, which, again, they haven't put up a price. But yeah, Sony says that they are looking into it. And one way or the other, we should know tomorrow because they claim that they're going to be dumping all this data tomorrow if nobody pays for it. But yeah, should you be worried? Maybe. At this point, it's hard to say. If Just to be safe, it might be better to maybe take down all your credit card information, wait a couple days see how it goes and then just re-register all that information later just to be on the safer side. A lot of people have changed their passwords and that sort of thing. So if you are feeling nervous, feel free to go ahead and take those safety precautions.